boom, here we go. Battlerap.com, redemption, end of the night. Uh, we just saw the main event. Uh, sure. Introduce yourself, first of all. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You already know it's your boy T-Rex, the general of Battle Rap, man. Dot Mob in the fucking building. So, uh, how are you feeling, first of all? Oh, I'm feeling good, man. I'm just happy to be back in the building, back on tasting blood again. You know what I'm saying? Right. And so this redemption card felt like it might have been named after you, you know, the, with the Charlie Clips thing. Um, and we've, we've talked about that. So uh, do you feel like you've redeemed yourself? Of course. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. Uh, I felt like I redeemed myself after Canada. You know what I'm saying? Right, with the Hollahan battle. With yeah. the Hollahan battle. But you but know, like, this was over here on this stage right, now. Same stage, same crowd, you know yeah. what I mean? The same. No, nah, it wasn't the same crowd. The crowd was kind of light tonight. Yeah. Cowboys crowd was kind of light tonight. It wasn't a bunch of, it wasn't, I mean, it wasn't my usual crowd, I would say. But, I mean, it was a crowd. So, I mean, mm. it was here. Fuck it. Deal with what you get. Uh, thoughts on Danny's performance? Uh, Danny's performance is Danny. It's usually Danny. Danny's good, man. Literally, Danny is good. I think a lot of Danny bars be overhyped. He moving so much, it like it be into that. But you know, that's. I mean, what you like is what you like, man. I don't know. Right. Yeah. Uh, did it feel like because uh, your battle happened right uh, after the kind of scuffle there? It seemed like things didn't quite get out of hand that much, but that that battle was canceled. Was there a moment where you felt like this battle was going to get canceled as well? Nah, me and Danny was sitting downstairs, so we kind of laughed and shit. Like, yo, no matter what happened, we doing this shit today. So, mm -hmm. I'm saying, we wasn't really worried about it being canceled, though, because, you know what I mean, they, Beasley got things under control real quick. Shout out right. to Beasley. Mm -hmm. and also, I was laughing, because you were saying, like, you know, the two of you guys were just, like, sitting down here for a lot of the night, watching the TV, watching, like, the, what was going on upstairs. And so I was like, are they really friendly? Like, what's, you know, what's going to happen in the ring? And then as soon as you hit the ring, like... It felt, especially on your part, with like the animosity of just like, you know, your defense of like, oh, I hate this guy's bars, and it was just like, it definitely felt like there wasn't, a, it wasn't a friendly battle. Not at all. I mean, for one, Danny, forty years old, man. <laughs> Danny's old enough to know that this shit is a business. You know right. what I'm saying? How old are you, by the way? I beat thirty this year. Okay. So, um, Danny is um. We both grown ass men, you know what I mean? We know for a fact us sitting right here don't mean we ain't gonna get in there and fuck each other up. Like, it's ain't nothing personal. Mm -hmm. We both got a job to do. Let's do that and then it's over with. You know what I'm saying? I noticed uh, with this event specifically, there was like, there's, because I'm 34, so I'm like getting old and when I'm in a venue and there's like a, tw a 17 year old kid battling, like when Chess is battling, it's like that kid is so young. Like he could be my essentially be my son. He could yeah. be Danny's son. Um, so are you seeing like as you get older, since you've been around for like for so long, um, that are you like? Do you feel like there's this new generation coming in with battle rap? It's definitely a new. The new generation of battle rap they move a little more, which don't mean nothing. You know what I'm saying? And I don't think they're direct as our generation was. You know what I mean? Like we're more to the point. We're more means something. We more we got we have more. More. We have more general lines. You know, our lines can hit more people. It ain't just for you. It ain't. I mean, that ever is a special ever because you had to have them rhymes at any time also. Mm. So this new battle rap is different. I mean, like you know, they got the Sue Surfers, the Hitmans, all of them. That's they came from our era still, even though they was younger than us. Yeah. They come from our era, the Calicos and all of them because they are still raw. A lot of these new nigga shit, you kind of see it coming, you know what I mean? But That's just it, it also, I, I agree, and like, uh, it feels like with this new generation of both battlers and fans, that there's this like necessity to punch every second bar, every fourth bar, every bar even. And like, you see that with a guy like Danny Myers or B Magic or, um, you know, these, these guys that are able to just like back to back to back punches. Right. Um, whereas your style is like, you dr like, it's, I don't wanna say drawn out, but it's like, you let it breathe a bit more. It's like, you'll work your way to something. And I'm just wondering like, is that, is there still room for that style? Like, it feels like it's kind of underappreciated these days. Um, that style sets you up for bigger punches. Mm. You know, you can boom, 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 but then you go boom, 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 boom. It's like, you, what you what you want? I'm at you. I want to land hard. So, I'm saying, that I feel like, you know, I'll be lining you up. I can't wait for the remix to that, by the way. As soon as somebody puts a trap beat under it, it's going to be fire. Yeah. So, you know, it's all for that. Speaking of, the, speaking of one of the fathers, 
You first? Yes, yeah, sir. Yeah. I gotta get one. Thank let's you. let's um let's do this. Let's let's do this interview right now. Um, do you want to trade out? Shit. Hell